So you've snapped off a key of your keyboard and you can't seem to get it back in. Or maybe one key has broken and you want to take it apart and see what's going on. Let me show you how to put one of these laptop keys out and put it back in and the safe way to do it. The key caps on the laptop are very easy to break and if you try and pull it off without understanding how it works, you'll most likely snap something. This is what it looks like on the inside. That's the retainer and this is a key here. On the back of the key, there are usually two areas where it holds on to parts of the retainer and two areas where it holds on to little legs that come out. Now this particular retainer is broken. As you can see, I can remove it like this. You shouldn't be able to remove it like this. These little bits here in the middle should be attached to this. There should be a little leg here. And this usually fits in like this so that it can go up like a like an, an angle. So it creates a spring mechanism. Now to remove the key safely so that you don't snap these two bits or these bits here, you will need a pair of tweezers like this or a very, very small flathead screwdriver or a plastic spudger. Let's take the Y key for example. Now when I go and remove this, I don't want to just use my finger and pull it off because if you do, with enough force, you'll snap it, and then yes, it'll come out. But if you do pull it off, you need to use a pair of tweezers. Now, you've got to go underneath the key. Now, remember the key here, this one here, is attached to this. So you want to go underneath. If I'm looking on the reverse side, I'm going to go underneath like that and support this. So we're feeling our way for underneath the retainer clip. You should be able to go straight through. And at that point, like you should be perpendicular. You can move this up and up, so upwards, and that will release the clip. So you can see here, the clip is still intact. The two little teeth that are holding on. And also, this particular retainer clip is still still has its pieces here to remove this retainer clip if you ever need to you want to find the bit that is hooked on here not this one start removing this one to remove it you need to this is really tricky because they're hooked on and you have to get it under here and push it out very gently pry it upwards if you pry it too hard you're gonna snap it and then it will it'll be, that'll be over then you have to buy one So this is a very delicate, there you go, that's one. So lift gently and there. 
and even the middle bit is still intact. So it should it should look like this. It should hold on. There's that little piece. If it comes off, just gently push it back in. It's a very sm very small piece of plastic. To put it back on, this one we're going to put this the bottom hook first. And then we're going to press the top. Push it down with a spudger like that. And then this is still hooked in here. So hook it here, then push here and push here. Now we get our key. And we place it directly on top and we push down one corner here one corner here if done correctly your key is not going to come off and when you try and lift it it's not going to come off and it'll bounce just like the other keys And that's how you take apart and put back together a laptop key.